Hey there guys, my name is Marquez and in this video I'm going to guide you how you can easily uh, like link bases in Airtable and what it means to link bases. So let's say I have a project tracker here and I want to combine with Cell CRM. So how to do it? So the first thing you want to do is when you're going to be here in Airtable, you want to next to the row height, you're going to find share view. Click on the share view. When you're gonna click on a share view, you're gonna find a thing here called allow data in this view to be synced to other bases. Click on it. And then you're gonna find another thing, sync this view to another base. Click on that too. Now, when you're gonna click on it, you're gonna have a workspace. So I'm going to click on a workspace like this one and then you need to choose a base. So I'm going to choose a base, which is going to be the cell CRM that I was talking about. So click on cell CRM or what, which one you want to have. And then you have option to create a sync table that will be kept up to date as this data changes, or you can copy this data into new table that you can edit. So I'm going to show you both of these ways. So I'm going to create a sync table, create table, and let's see what will happen. So here I can see sync table settings. Now I see sources. I can add records from another source if I want. Active Airtable all projects. Then you're going to automatically sync changes at regular intervals. So when requested or you can stop syncing changes and convert to unsigned table. And delete records, records when they are deleted or hidden in source. And now you click sync now. Sync completed. So what we actually have here is that I have right now the old projects uh, from the thing here. This can be edited right now. You see that everything is synced here with this like, I don't know, what is it? How would I call it? Like a storm or a thunder. So right now I can simply add a field. So I can add, let's say an email, create a field. So that's the first thing you can do. Now, when I go here and I go back, I go to project tracker and I can simply like, let's say I'm going to add a new YouTube video to do. Okay, and I'm going to change the status here and also the priority here. And now I go back. I go to cell CRM. And it's going to take a little while to actually like connect with, but you can find it right here. So you should be able to see that. So this is how we can do it. Now what I can do also is the second way. Let me show you. Or sing now. Here it was. Okay singing and now see here we are youtube video to do so to sync the projects all you have to do is click on a, this thing here and you can update you can add records from and you can update the sync configuration you can also even change change the source label So that's what you can do. Now let's say that I'm going to uh, delete the table, delete. I'm going to project tracker, share a view, again, allow data, sync this view to another base. And here I'm going to choose the same thing, but I'm going to copy the data. So Sanwi base cell CRM, copy this data, create a table. And here we are, here we have it, right? So you can copy the data, but as you can see, right now I can add a project, I can add a tasks, 
I wasn't able to do that before. And you see, you don't have the thunder here, or how would I call it? Also, when you click here, you, you just copied it. So right now, this is how we can do it. And this is how we can link the bases. So you had the two options here, what you can do. The first way is when you're going to click here and you're going to share the view, sync with another base, choose a workspace, choose a cell CRM, and I'm going to click create a sync table. Okay, sync now. Voila, here we got it. So you see the differences here between the between these two when you just copy them and when you sync them. Now, of course, in a sync, you can't edit the projects. You can add simply statuses, nodes, fields there. That's what you can do. And always when you're going to sync it, like when you're going to click here, sync now. So that's what will happen. So that's pretty much it. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Have a great day and goodbye.